goodness. Oh, hi, Fred. Good morning, buddy. Good morning. Oh, you're ripping. You are ripping today, buddy. Yeah! What up, y'all? Welcome back to another one. Oh, no. It is raining and sleeting out. This ain't good. We're supposed to be driving into a field today. Uh-oh. So, today is a big day, big hunt, y'all. My buddy Dan that works at Federal Ammunition, he's in town. He brought his other buddy. His buddy brought his son, and Dan brought his son as well. Now, a lot of my long-term subscribers, y'all remember back in, I think it was May or April, me and the wifey, Federal flew me and the wife up to Minneapolis, and we toured the entire plant. It was amazing. And, and while I was up there, I told my buddy Dan, I was like, hey, you need to get some people together, and you need to come down to Kansas, and you need to hunt this upcoming waterfowl season. Well... He made it. So we have four special guests in town all weekend. Uh, we're going to try to squeeze in three to four to five hunts possibly this whole weekend. I want to show them around. I want to show them a good time and I want to show them some amazing Kansas waterfowl hunting. We got a decent push of geese in, a lot of snow. So hopefully today we get some white birds down on the ground. But before we get into today's video, check out that old school hat from Ducks Waterfowl and that thermal hoodie. And underneath my pants, I got them Ducks Thermal Sweats. It's sleeting, it's raining, it's supposed to start snowing, it's cold, it's wet, and uh... Thank goodness I am warm. So if you want to pick up any of this gear from Ducks Waterfowl, I will link it all down in the description below. You guys know when you pick up something from Ducks, it goes directly to supporting your boy and helping me bring you guys more of these videos. But, uh, big hunt today, big spread, running two A-frames, eight guys total. Jordan, Wade, Mike, me, and the other four guys. Uh, massive hunt, we're gonna run all the full bodies we have, which should be 30 to 40 dozen. So we're talking big spread today. Big spread, big weather, big hunt. Hopefully it's a big showing. <laughs> oh, these boys, I just met them at McDonald's. They're like, uh, well, it was really warm yesterday. I'm like, welcome to Kansas. Look at it. It's sleeting and snowing now. So you know what that means. We got a lot of work ahead. I got to put down the camera. We got a lot of decoys to put up, y'all. Well, we've been working our buns off. You been working your buns off? Yes. You tired yet? A little bit. Are you cold? Not really. I don't no. think you're cold. I'm almost sweating. <laughs> you cold yet? Not yet. I'm get, sweating. I'm sweating. It's yeah. gonna get cold though, so just sit down, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> well, here we are. This is the blind situation. We got two A-frames. We use the evergreens today. And then, like I was saying, today we're running full bodies only. Look at that beauty. Good looking spread today. Very, very realistic spread today. We got a new decoy out too. We got some little uh, mojo spinning flags. So I'm anxious to see how they work. We're gonna get the trucks parked on the road, get out of here. We got about 30 minutes till shooting light and the weather is just yummy. Oh, oh, is it cold out, Fred? Huh? Is it cold? Are you cold? He ain't cold, he's just ready to go. We got a Fred fan though. You like Fred? Yeah. He's a good boy. I'll, I'll make him come cuddle with you here in a little bit. <laughs> okay. He gets he gets on my nerves. <laughs> well, we can hear the first birds. It's sleeting on us. Uh, it's gotten really, really cold. Really dense cloud cover today. I'm excited. They should give it up. They should be extremely vulnerable today, you know? <laughs> yes, don't move. <laughs> Let's shoot the ducks if they do it. Get ready, boys. Get ready. Get ready. Get ready. Get ready. Get ready. Shoot the ducks. Oh, he's dead. Nice shooting, boys. Two of the three. Good job. Did you get him? Good. Fred here. Let's go. Let's go. Awesome. Good job, dude. Fred, come on, sit, sit, give, good boy, sit, sit. Well, there we go, we got some green down, boys, woo-hoo! 
So this is the first day that Storm and Fred are working together too, and they're doing good so far. <laughs> Duck, right on your right. He landed, dude. <laughs> Duck just landed right there. He is, look at that. Behind us, right there in the decoy, standing the girl, the hen. See her? Have, have, hey, have him shoot him. Get your gun ready. Right here, look. Turn around with your gun. Turn around with your gun. See him on the ground? Show him, Dan. See that hand? Shoot that hand. Yeah, shoot, shoot him. Close your ears. Get that branch out of his face, Dan. There you go. Shoot him. Can you see him? Oh! Oh, almost. <laughs> Oh boy, we got we got about a thousand birds on the way, boys. It's about to get crazy. Let's just put them to rest, shall we? Here we go, boys. Get down. Get all get all the way down. Put your head way, way, way down. Well, they're here, boys. I had to whip out the big camera for this. Oh, goodness. Killed some white. Yeah. Nice. Oh, Here, Fred. <laughs> nice, dude. Woohoo! They got into him. Dirty. Oh, there are some dirty juvies in here. There's a good group, boys. Talk about the seagulls. That group. Yeah, we're we're a start shooting. We've I just wanted to see, you know. <laughs> Want to shoot them behind us or something? Over the top, boys, get ready. Shoot them! Oh! <laughs> that was a close shot. <sighs> Sorry. <laughs> Oh, uh, here Fred, here, good boy, here, 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 set, set, well we got us a little, little lesser, woo, here Fred, heel, set, he did a couple backflips, boys, yeah, Fred, that bird just got smoked, good job, boy, hey, you got something on your face there, boy, you got some war paint on you, huh, there we go, go down, whitey, go down, I'll shoot some white, Fred, here, that's a, look, he's a juvie, that's a gray bird, well, we got to snow down. Here, Fred, here. You didn't get that one, dude. Nope, she beat you. Got to snow down, got the lens wet. It's raining again. My goggles are just smoked. Look at that. I can't see nothing. <laughs> Set. On the right. Get ready, boys. They're, they're going to do it. <laughs> Shoot them over the top. Shoot them. go boom he did good friend here let's go
I'm gonna shoot him right here. Okay, shoot him. <laughs> boom, boom, baby. Well, there we go. Gonna take what we can get today, boys. Good, Fred, Fred he here. <laughs> Want to shoot him out front? Shoot him! Yep. Friends, let's go! Here! Well, the guys got into another group here. I didn't have the camera on. Here, Fred, let's go. Here. Here. Fred, here. Here. Let's go. Uh, we got snow geese down. If, if you guys are liking the video, hit the thumbs up button for your boy. You got to. Good boy, Fred. Give. Ah. Ha ha. <laughs> Probably should have shot him right there. Yeah. More snows, baby, more snows. Oh boy. Well, y'all, the weather's making these birds extra vulnerable. What is it, like 9? 9 o'clock, 9 9.30? Probably 9, 9.30. I can't even pull out my phone. I'm so busy. But we got them going on here, boys. We're getting into them. They are vulnerable today with this weather. We got a big group to the left. <laughs> What you got there? Got you a good looking adult snow goose there. Yeah. Is that your first snow goose? Um, I didn't shoot it. You didn't shoot that one? No. That's all right, you can still be yours. <laughs> <laughs> well, here we are, 31 lessers, 46 total. Got some ducks, got some snows. First hunt to Kansas, right? First first bird hunt and duck hunt in Kansas, absolutely. Yeah, it Phenom worked out. Phenomenal. Wait, it, it was a little, little rough at first, but... It was rough at first, but, I was scared. Yeah. I was like, hey, uh, Dan, I don't know what to tell you, but <laughs> yeah. hopefully these yeah. birds don't land in the middle and, of the field. And I don't even know if I'd call it rough, but yeah. they just weren't finished in the way I they think we were looking for. Right, the match, it, but it sure ended up good. Well, it was awesome. <laughs> <laughs> That's right, yeah. At first, the birds wanted to land all the way out in the middle of the field, 
Jordan went out there, put out some scarecrows, and thank goodness he did because, man, it turned into a good hunt. Well, we're driving into the field here. The lens is getting foggy. But uh, it has spit freezing rain on us all morning. It snowed and freezing rain. This morning when we were sitting up, it was sprinkling and raining on us. And I was worried, I'm like, I'm hoping this turns to freezing rain and snow like it was supposed to. Thank goodness it did, because if it didn't, we probably wouldn't be driving in the field right now. The four guys I got in from Federal Ammo. Uh, awesome hunt, awesome first hunt, you know what I'm saying? Really knocked it out of the park. At the beginning I was like, oh goodness, because the geese wanted to shortstop us a bunch, but then it just worked out. Once the snow started falling, these birds went from being really weary to just hungry and giving it up they started locking their wings at 70 yards and coasting to us you know what i mean before there was this snow on the ground we were not getting that type of commitment even close not even close you know what i mean so weather guys weather 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 hold on the hold on the lens is foggy again i have always preached to you guys weather when you get bad weather in cold it is gonna make your birds vulnerable. They're gonna be hungry. They're gonna give it up more. They're not gonna examine the spread as much and be, and be so choosy, you know what I mean? So, you always hear about the fair weather hunter. You can be a fair weather hunter all the time, but if you wanna kill them, if you wanna trick them, you know what I mean? If you wanna fool them, you gotta get out there on these days like this. Ooh, look at the unit, all muddy and wet, yeah. And all snowy, I love it. Uh, this is the stack of evergreens we use for both A-frames, two A-frames a day, eight guys. And man, you guys already have the spread picked up. It's because we work. That was a good one, dude. Oh, that was a banger. Did you love it? Oh, yeah. I loved it. It was great. <laughs> it was great. It was great. just great. <laughs> but like I said, we use full bodies only. And uh, it worked. I wish we would have set it a little bigger. I think we got a, I think we could have got a better commitment if we would have set it just a hair bigger. Maybe sprinkled in some socks, some silhouettes, but they already almost have it all picked up. 35 dozen full bodies is what it was today. Oh, hi there, Frederick. Favorite time of the day for Mr. Frederick. You ready, buddy? There you go, bud. Look at that tail. Look at that tail. Well, it is 2.30 in the afternoon. We got all of our birds clean. We had lunch. And now I think everybody's gonna take a little snoozer and then we're all gonna start scouting by about 3.30. So that gives me an hour to get me in a snoozer if that happens. It seems like I don't usually get good naps. So, or a nap at all for that sake. Getting up at 4 a.m. Ooh, it puts it in you, you know what I mean? It says, Dad, I'm ripping, ready to go. I guarantee you. We could take Fred on a duck hunt right now and he'd just kill the game. He ain't tired for nothing. You're a trooper, Frederick. You're a trooper. But today was Fred and Storm's first hunt together. And thank goodness they did awesome because they're gonna be hunting together for the rest of their lives. If y'all don't know, if you're new to the channel, so Wade, Storm's daddy, the little black lab, me and Wade have been hunting together for about 15 years. We started waterfowl hunting together. We started duck hunting public together. That's how we initially got into waterfowl hunting. And then as broke teenagers and, and broke 20 year olds, what did we do? We put our money together and we bought decoys. Now I do have to give it to Wade. He invested a lot more money than me at the beginning and thank goodness, because if he hadn't, we wouldn't be here today. We would not be here today. You know what I mean? We got to provide a, a, a hunt for our buddies at Federal Premium Ammunition. And a lot of you guys know that Federal has basically, you know, sponsored the channel for the past two seasons pretty much. But Federal just isn't a sponsor. Uh, Dan, him and his son came. And, and Dan is the main, my main contact at Federal. He's the one that me and my wife, we went up there and we shot fully auto guns down in the federal basement and all that jazz. You guys seen those videos. I got him here and his son for his son's first goose hunt. His first waterfowl hunt ever. How freaking special is that? I mean, I'm just blown away by today. 
Uh, it was an amazing hunt. It turned out a lot better than I was kind of thinking it might. Uh, almost 50 birds, you know what I mean? That is one heck of a hunt. So I'm so glad that the first hunt went just premium. Let's hope we have a next good two days because they're here all weekend. Today's Friday, we're hunting Saturday, Sunday, and then they're going home. I just feel so privileged to, to be able to have the chance to provide them a hunt like this a, a few days of hunting this is this is their vacation this is their mancation you know i can't wait for the day that i take my son on his first hunt whether it's in my backyard or two thousand miles away you know what i mean now they are from minneapolis minnesota so uh they drove down all four of them yesterday and uh they're absolutely wiped but they might go coyote hunting here in a little bit and i'm gonna go scouting here in a little bit but thank you all for being here. I hope you enjoyed today's hunt. I hope you guys learned something, because I sure did. We rocked to nothing but full bodies. I wish we would have made the spread a little bigger with some silos and socks, but it worked. Like I always say, guys, if you're hunting and something isn't working, if the birds are just not liking your stuff, switch something up. You're not going to lose anything, you know what I mean? If the birds don't like it, switch something up. It always helps. But hit that little notification bell down there. It will notify you when your boy uploads because we have a lot of hunting to come this season and not just waterfowl. We're going to get into some coyote hunting. We're going to get into some beaver trapping. We're going to get into a lot of new things. So stick around. Subscribe if you haven't, guys. If you like this video, please smash that thumbs up button. Let's get this video over 2,000 likes. But until next time. Peace.